Hey peeps, Polly here, and today we are going to be playing Play Together. I wanted to go over <clears throat> what I do every day in game. So I just logged in, like this is brand new, fresh logged in. I always collect my daily reward. Now, you can either hit the collect reward button or you can hit the times two and watch a video. Um, but I pay like $4.99, it's like $5 and change, to completely remove all ads, and that's for the entire month long. So I personally like to do that because I can't stand ads. They, they drive me crazy. I don't even watch TV anymore because of commercials. I just, it, it, it irritates me <laughs> and interrupts my game flow, and I'm like, you know what, if it's only five bucks and it's for the whole entire month of me being able to log in every day and never being hit with any ad i'm good with it but even still um if you want to watch the ads usually it's like a cute little mini game that you can play um sometimes uh it won't be a game but more often than not i found that they give me a little a little mini game um and it usually only lasts like 15 seconds, maybe 20 seconds. So it's not like it's a, a long commercial or something, which is nice. But I'm going to go ahead and collect this reward. And Big Scoops always comes in with the latest news. But I'm not going over news today. You guys can check that out at your own time. So uh, every time you log into the game, the first time you log in, you'll always be standing here. And if you'll notice... These people standing around here that are like asleep and stuff, if you're wondering why they're here or why they're standing around like that, it's because they're farming likes. So if you come in and you like see somebody that you think is cute or whatever, you, you tap on them. Well, I don't know why it's not. Tight. Yeah, you tap on them and you can hit the little like button or whatever, but that's that's what they're doing. I've had some people ask me like, why are, why are they doing that? That's weird. <laughs> um... So, what I do when I do my dailies is I usually start off with this over here, this daily missions. So if you tap that, you can go through and, and either watch all the videos that are on here, or you can like navigate to the quest and actually go and follow your little navigation tracks and go do whatever the little daily mission is, like the little quest. So like catch card packs with a bug net. If I'm already out catching bugs and I see a card pack, I'm gonna catch it too. And that would automatically complete that one. Um, role play downtown, role play at the downtown fire station. So like if you go downtown, you go to the fire station, there will be a little quest down there at the fire station for you to do. You do the quest and that's considered role play. So if you're doing quests for Kaya Cash, you're going to be doing these anyway, and you're going to collect these rewards, which are crowns. So all the crowns go toward the um, the, the season pass. Um, so right now it's the dolphin season, you know, and it'll end in 11 days. It always tells you how long it's going to last up here. Um... So as you collect more crowns, you'll work toward more of the rewards that you want, or if you paid for the premium, you can get the all the stuff in the premium shop. You can also, let me see, let me get this little, sorry, I got my recording buttons in the way. Um, you can even hit this up here to watch the three ads to get even more crowns. So I always hit those to get those done. And I'll go ahead and complete, I just will go ahead and complete my daily missions. Because, I mean, yeah, sure, I'm going to be taking care of some of this stuff anyway. But if I end up playing for a while and I don't mine, then I'd miss out on that. I'd forget that to check to see if I had done all the things. So I just like to go ahead and get them all out of the way before anything else. Let's collect all these crowns. Crowns, not crayons. <laughs> Words are hard. All right, card pack. Oh, and when opening gifts, 
if it's multiple gifts, I usually hit the little button in the corner that says collect all. So if you didn't know that you could do that, you can totally do that. And sometimes it saves you some time when loading presents that are like a purple gift, a purple item or whatever, it's going to give you this big screen, this big little cut screen of, of, of you getting it. And it takes a little while. So if you're in a rush for time, just hit collect all and it won't give that screen. So next I like to go through and just get, get rid of the new stuff, anything that's got a new on it, just by scrolling through until I've looked at all of them. Alright, school life, there we go. And go to notice, check my friend request, see if there's any that I can send any to anyone. No, not yet. I, I keep these here until I have the card, and then once I have the card, I'll be able to, to send it. And then from there, I go to this free rewards, and all of these you can just watch the little video or if like like me pay to not have to watch it you just click and receive them and it all goes to your inbox okay and then I go to shop oh oh look that's new that's cute I like it I mean it's it's kind of weird but it's kind of cute too is that a starfish face no it's like it's, I guess it's a cloth. It's part of the, that's really cool though. Ha, huh, neat. Okay. Um, nothing new that I'm, that I'm aware. So what I do here is these little, let me go back up to the top. These, these little dots here, they'll tell you that you have something to do that's free. So click on the thing and then go over and check and see, ha, huh, see free and you hit free, and you collect the things. Now, this one, I, oh, I got another staff. <laughs> I had got this staff the other day, and I was so excited about getting this staff because if you use the little action on it, you'll float. So, in, and it's pink, and it goes with my pink outfit. I have a blue staff that floats, but it's not pink, and I need something with my pink outfit. Shoes, free. And again, I have many of the shoes and I have this dress as well. So all of this would be sprout points for me. See, because you can remember I told you about how you can recycle your things that you don't need anymore if you got duplicates or whatever. Sprout points. And this one, you know, I'm, I have no interest in these workout body things because girl. Um, but these yoga mats, I'd like to get this pink yoga mat. That'd be pretty cool. Um... That could be useful to me, but if I already had this, I would still roll for these because of the gemstone, the diamonds, I mean, and the gems and the Kaya stars. And, and honestly, this stuff here, the wasabi and the boiled shrimp and the fried egg, that's used in crafting stuff as well. So all of these items are like crafting gear. So if you don't necessarily want the thing, the thing of the whatever the week is, whatever the giveaway is, um, still hit the, the roll, still hit your freebies because there's other stuff that you could use as well. Yay. Yay gems. Two gems. See, that's what I'm saying. Like there's a lot of ways to earn gems easily in this game. You don't have to feel like you've got to buy them or anything. I had a friend who was very much like, I'm, I'm not going to spend money on the game, I, I don't want to. I would rather play everything free and save up. And she was able to save up like 700 gems within, uh, I don't know, maybe two months. Maybe two or three months she was able to save up 700 gems. And she bought herself the, um, the wizard house. So when you're at your housing, when you're at your home, you can go to your housing board and you can change what house you have. There's like one that looks like a wizard castle. She bought that with her gems that she saved up from never playing or never spending money on it. It was great. So that's one of the reasons why I really like play together is because they are so generous with their giveaways. And even look at that play reward cash. Kaya stars just got some just for being logged in. They'll, they'll send you Kaya stars just for playing for a while, which is awesome. All right, let's go ahead and get this one. 
This is the other one that you want to be able to do if you've got the sprout points to be able to do it. Because you can get gems and stars and if you get have the full outfit already, which I do, it's more sprout points for more gems and Kaya Cash. And I'll go ahead and do the... Actually, no, I'm not going to do the legendary draw because the only thing that I don't have from it is the hair. And that's the only thing I'd want. And I keep getting everything else. So I'm, j I'm just, I'm going to skip it. I don't want it. I don't want it. All right. And then we will go to the Upgradeite package. And I didn't get the chance to explain how Upgradeite works before in my last video. I will explain that this time it has to do with fishing rods. Sanrio, um, if you like Hello Kitty and you want the Hello Kitty things, this is your little reminder to go and do the, um, the Hello Kitty dailies. Because when you do the Hello Kitty dailies, you get these ticket things and you take them to the craft station and you can craft you one of these, one of these tickets. So we'll go and do those as well because they're super easy. I'll show you guys how to do them. Um get these ones there's always two free in this category in this little don't miss the daily special prizes and then there's this one and this one and these five of these and these are your game tickets your play game like the fall guys and stuff like that that's your tickets for that and then we've got these more upgradeites, which we will need for the fishing rod. Gotta get a good fishing rod. Okay, done. And that's, that's it. And sometimes when you scroll up, it'll say you've still got tickets available, but it's wrong. And when you close out, you won't have the little red exclamation point on shop anymore. It'll be gone. And then what I also do is I check daily. So, um, there's always a, a, a login reward. Sometimes it's only set, most of the time it's only seven days. So if you haven't gotten your seven day login rewards, make sure you get those. And then this here is also a reminder for the event that's going on. If you need to go and take care of the event to work toward more of the rewards, make sure you do that. I got the the skin most recently and I was so so excited because oh my god it looks it looks so good with her she's so creepy and spooky and I love it um so make sure that you go and do your your daily quests for these little reminder let's see what's this four day oh yeah that's the if you want to buy the things I don't want to buy the things and then we'll go into inbox and we hit receive all and that will give you your stars and your gemstones that you got but it doesn't give you like all the things so make sure that you go through and click all the things so we'll receive this and I've got three in here so I'm gonna hit open all that way I can pass through the load screens for them ba, ba, ba gemstones nine gems nice ten gems woo see you guys uh, that's what I'm saying it's super easy to get a hold of gems if you don't feel like paying receive and receive oh and the shovels and the drills so those are for an event called uh, the forgotten island and what that does, it usually happens on the weekend. It's usually like a three-day thing. And it'll give you a chance to go to this desert island. And at this desert island, there's treasure chests buried in the sand. And your shovel or your little drill will act as a um, one of those metal detectors. You know, like you see the people on the beach with the metal detector holding it, trying to find treasure. Yeah, that's exactly what you do. You hold your little drill or you hold your little shovel and it'll beep, 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 beep as you're walking along. And then when you get closer to the treasure, it'll beep, 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 beep. You know, it'll get rapid beeps. And then you get to that spot and you dig and it'll pop out a little treasure chest and it, it'll either be 
like Kaya Stars, the cash, or gemstones, or um, furniture, or clothes, um, like basic furniture or clothes, um, or it'll be the, the outfit. If you're lucky, it'll be the outfit. So make sure that if you go f for the event, that it's definitely an outfit that you're like, oh my God, I cannot live without that. I have to have that outfit. It's so me. Because there was an event for a pirate outfit and I was like oh that's cool I want it and so I went and I spent all of my drills and then the next weekend came along and it was an axolotl outfit and I don't know if you know what an axolotl is but you guys should look it up I don't know how to a-x-o-l-o-t-y-l I think actually it's a little aquatic creature and they had it in blue and I was like oh my god it's so cute and so I spent all of my drills that I had accumulated the previous week on that, trying to get it, never got it. And then the next week after, there was a pink axolotl outfit. And I was like, you know what? If I had just saved <laughs> all of the drills from pirate and blue axolotl, I would have had way more drills to be able to get a hold of the pink axolotl. And you can, you can buy extra drill, drills when you're out there. Um, I'm not sure. I think they cost gemstones. I'm, I'm pretty sure they don't cost dollars, like real money. Um, they may only cost gemstones, but I'm not, I'm not certain on that. But even still, like if you're trying to save your gemstones for something like a house or something, you know, like it, it all comes down to priority of, of what you want most. But like I said, that event only happens on the weekends. And just make sure that if you go, that it's really an outfit that you want because your drills are a gamble. You're either going to get the thing or you're not going to get the thing and, and waste your drills. So, uh, whoop. <laughs> went to sleep there. All right. Then after you do all that, you go to downtown, and there's some dailies that we need to take care of down here. So I'm going to get in here, and what I like to do is I like to go to the bank first. So let's pull out the mount and go to the bank. And the dailies reset at 8 p.m. EST. Uh, so if you don't know your time, you know, if you don't know it for what time zone you're in, just go to your search engine and type in 8 p.m. EST to MST or GST or, you know, whatever your time zone is. And it'll tell you. But you come over here to the teller. And we'll deposit our hundred stars. And once we get to day 15, we'll get 2,000. Uh, 2,000 stars back and we'll get uh, 20 gems. No, I already talked to you. Thank you. All right. Oh, and again, this, this is another place where people will come and they'll farm likes. So they'll stand here from like 8 p.m. till whenever, I don't know, and they'll like, they're, they're farming for likes. <laughs> so be sure to send hearts to the people who you think are like cute outfits or cool profile or whatever, you know. It's nice. It's a friendly little thing to do. Okay, now we're gonna go this way since we're in downtown and I definitely want my Hello Kitty and Kuro Me and my Melody stuff, we're going to go to the Sanrio Hotel and do the dailies in here. And I'll show you guys like how quick and how easy these things are to do. I mean, it's, it's super fast, especially if you've done them before and you know what you're doing. So, Karomi always has the same quest, so we'll talk to her. And her quest is she left valuables in somebody's room, but she doesn't have the time to go and get them, so we gotta go get them for her. So we'll do that, it's in 201. Remember to grab the key card 
That way you can get in. It's this little black thing on the desk. You come over and click it, and it'll give you the card, and your character will hold it. And you come over here, and you take the elevator up to second floor. And then you go in here, and we're going to room 201. Now, this is one of the ones like where the, the path will tell you where to go, but once you get in here, it's not going to lead you exactly to the item. So you're going to have to like look around and try to find, but it's letting you know, hey, it's in here somewhere. Oh, I see it over there. So look for glittery. You see the glittery over here? Um, that's it. It even looks like a necklace when you get close to it, and it's got the little hand. So if you see the hand, you know you need to pick that thing up. All right, let's return to Kuromi. And I... I love this hotel so much. I love how they like themed every single one of the rooms after a Sanrio character. Like it's just, it's the best. I'm a huge, huge Hello Kitty fan, Sanrio fan. And when they, when PT came out with this, I was just like, oh, for real, oh my God, I can't believe they're doing it. I was so excited. Super, super excited. Look at us, we're so cute together. Oh, okay, thank you. Here's a little gift for you, a reward, yay, times three. Thank you, thank you, Kuromi. And next is my Melody. Now, my Melody's quest is always to take a picture with one of the Sanrio characters. Okay, so, oh, uh, with Hello Kitty. Okay, let's go over and take a picture with Hello Kitty. Oh, by the way, I don't know if you guys know or not, but I heard that Hello Kitty is not a cat. She's actually a little girl in a cat costume. And her name is Kitty White. I I never knew that. I just assumed that much like all the other Sanrio characters that she was just a cat. You know, like that's the little, little cat and Pom Pom Puran is a, a puppy and like, you know, they're they're animals. But no, she's she's not. She is apparently a little girl in a cat costume. So, I, I didn't know that before, but if you didn't know, check check it out. It blew my mind. I was like, what, are you kidding me? For real? So, <clears throat> another tip that I wanna tell you guys is if you're taking a photo with anybody, always stand to the left of the person. That way in the headlines, when it's printed in the paper, it's gonna say, Polly McPuffin and blah, blah, blah. We're saying, no. <laughs> that's a quote from a movie. But no, the reason <laughs> is because when you're in the photo mode, they're going to be on the left side of the camera. If I had stood to the right of her, they would be over where this person is. And she, Hello Kitty would be over here. So just be sure to stand to the left of them so that they're in the photo with you. All right. There we go. Got that done. And she says do a cute pose, but you don't have to pose. I used to think you had to pose, and I was posing for every single one of them. And then I took it, and I was like, oh, I didn't have to pose at all. <laughs> Okay, got that done. Collect reward, done. All right, and then we move on to Sanamaro. I, well, actually, no, we'll go ahead and do Hello Kitties while we're here. I don't wanna forget about hers. Hers is, again, always the same. All of them are always the same. Karumi is gonna have you get her artifact for, or get her necklace or whatever from a room. My Melody is gonna have you take a picture with the character. Hello Kitty is gonna have you clean rooms, and she's the only one that will give you two quests clean rooms and manage the front desk. And then Pom Pom Purin uh, has you cook something for a guest. And Cinnamon Roll has you um, explore the, the hotel with her. So we'll go ahead and go up and clean the room. Always remember to grab your key card. If you don't have it, be sure to get that key card. You're gonna need it to get into the rooms. The only quest that you won't need your key card on is the the cooking one because you're just you're not going into the room if you're going into the room for the quest grab the key card but if you're not going into the room for the quest you won't need it all right let's see ah clean the bed let's get that off of there clean the desk and it'll tell you like over here what what needs to be done next clean the floor ah, there we go see so clean the restroom Return to Hello Kitty. Simple done. Ba, ba, ba. And then we go back to the elevator. 
and back downstairs. When this event first took place, you could get this little hotel outfit and you got this little Hello Kitty uh, scooter thing to like run around in. It, it was adorable. Done. Excellent work. Yay. Okay. Now we're going to man the desk for her. Take over as greeter. And click the desk. So for these, it's going to be four things that you have to remember. And the thing that you need to remember is the name of where they registered, which is pt.com. Uh, for her uh, Monday so remember the name of where they registered the day that they're registered for how many people for her and her husband so two and she talks some stuff and then she says uh, the, the digits the last four digits of the phone number so always remember the name how many people what day and the numbers zero three three zero and i'll show you another tip too to help remember what you've got going on she went with pt.com so that's orange the next three are going to be orange more often than not it's the next three are orange and then the last one is blue it was for monday so another orange there were two guests another orange and now the last one the blue zero three three zero is blue so if your first one is orange, remember that it's going to be three orange and one blue. Okay. Oh, I'll go ahead and do cinema rose. Hello. Okay, let's go. All right, now cinnamon rolls, they'll show you where to go and navigate and cinnamon roll moves like really slowly. You do not have to wait for her. She will catch up. Just go and, and click the thing. Click the thing that needs to be clicked. Thank you. All right, next. Yay. All right, and then we can go take a bath. Bath. Right, and next is take a photo in the photo zone. Well, we don't actually have to take a photo, but she wants to show us the, the photo zone. So if you're into selfies, it's a good spot. This big wall back here, I love it. It's so cute. And come back here, and there we go. We're done. So if you like, um, if you like Hello Kitty, if you like Sanrio, who's your favorite Sanrio? Like, I mean, obviously everybody loves Hello Kitty, but do you have a second favorite? Like me, my second favorite is Kuromi. I love Kuromi and my melody. I mean, oh my gosh, they're, they're my vibe. Like I, I can be very pink and very girly and very pastel. And then I can also be very metal and very goth and very anarch. I've got like a mix of both, so. <laughs> uh, and I, you know, crazy enough, I can even be cozy, like cozy core cottage vibes. Like, I don't know. Just a hodgepodge. <laughs> and I think, oh, nope. That wasn't all of me. I had to get pom pom pudin. Pom pom pudin. All right, for his, it's cooking. We're making fish steak. So obviously you're going to use fish and not mango. Not bad. Which ingredient is next? Oil or duran? Duran, I think, is a type of fruit. Um, and that, we're not, we're not making fruit. We're making fish steak, so oil to cook it in. What's finishing touch? Obviously you're not going to want gold ore. That's, ew, salt. Yay. All right, that's it. And then we take it to room 201, confirm. And see, like I said, how you won't need the key card. If you tried to equip the key card, it's going to remove the food that she's holding in her hands. So that's why I say you don't need. And, and it even puts you in the little hotel outfit because it means like, hey, I'm a worker. And then you go up there just to the door. Let's see. This. This. And go over here. Boom. Room service. Housekeeping. <laughs> All right, done. 
She said that smelled fishy. It's fish. It's hello. <laughs> like, it wasn't sushi. Like sushi's not supposed to smell fishy. If your sushi smells fishy, your your sushi is bad. But well, sashimi. If your sashimi smells fishy, um, but it, we we were giving her fried fish. <laughs> Okay. All right. So that was all. That was it. Done. Got all of. Oh, I didn't even notice those banners up there. <gasps> this is the first time I'm seeing those banners. Ah, oh, that's so cute. I didn't even see those before. Wow. And I've been playing this game for a while. <laughs> okay. So that was all. We got all of the Sanrio stuff done. So let's go back to hometown now. To or not hometown. I'm sorry. Um the plaza so i could go through these doors to a little load screen and then go over to the subway station and go through to another load screen or i could just hit my phone and hit the go to plaza simple done okay now let's go since we got those Hello Kitty dailies done. We're going to go, or well, the Sanrio Hotel dailies done. We're going to go over here to the crafter. Let's see a little hammer up there. You'll notice the crafter. And we'll talk to Buff J. And we'll craft our Sanrio draw ticket. It's going to be under special, and it's up at the top. And we'll skip with a video. And that's it. That's done for that. Wait a minute. I just noticed they had a second... Let me go back into that craft. Oh, okay. You can sort by the tabs up here, too. I saw that, and I thought maybe there was more stuff that we could craft, but there's not. Alrighty. Got that draw, so let's go ahead and do the draw before we forget. and see what we get. It's under this. And we'll go to this and click and draw. Pew. Oh, a sink. Nice. A oh, bathroom sink. Not what I wanted, but it works. <laughs> I, I really want that scooter, y'all. I've, I've been doing it every day trying to get that scooter. All right, so and the, the last thing that I like to do um, before completing, like, other stuff is go to the campground and get that daily done as well. So we'll go here. And Whoop. Oh, by the way, these two guys here, they're the ones that are going to give you the quests to get your little tree pots. So like you can have flower pots and you can have tree pots. These are the guys that have the, the tree pots. So if you want to grow little trees, talk to those guys. You get two, I think, the first day and then a third on the next day, I think. I don't know. That, that event happened like a long time ago, so I don't remember exactly what, but I know you can still get the pots from it. Hello, Gru. Yes, back to water the guardian tree, please. Take the watering can with you. And I I love, I absolutely love this watering can. It's just so freaking cute. Oh my gosh. Like, I can't, I can't get enough. And how the little rainbow and the little sprouts pop up when you water it. And it's just, it's too precious. All right, so there's the diamonds. Let's go back to the plaza. And the last daily mission will check rewards. Did I do something that I didn't? Huh? Oh, I missed one. Okay. Huh. Wow. All right. So the last thing that I like to do is whatever event dailies there are. And there's, there's like always going to be an event going on. So as soon as one event ends, they pop up with a new one. So this is a spooky event that's going on right now. I'll go ahead and go through these two because, like I said, these quests are, like, super fast, super easy. And I'll just show you how they go. 
Oh my, so many people in here today. All right, let's do this. Now she says that she wants to find the name tags. Now when you first come in here to do these, you'll do like introductory quests to this whole storyline that's going on. So you'll do a little bit of different things, but once you got the gist of it, it's always gonna be the same thing. You're gonna be get, getting the name tags and then you're gonna have to find the, the voodoo doll that she left behind, and then you've got to go and save the little boy that's too scared to leave the school that's hiding out in the bathroom. So don't forget to get the little boy in the bathroom because <laughs> he's way back there and I always forget about him. All right, there we go. And now she says, oh my gosh, do you hear that? She's still here. Sounds like it's coming from the drama club room. Yep, all right, back to the drama club room. A ghost is still here. Help us. She's still lingering. I'm out of breath. I can't dance anymore. Please help. No more dancing. <laughs> I, I gotta admit, the first time I played this, like through all these quests and stuff and came in here, I got a little spooked. And I really did because there weren't a whole lot of people playing and it was dark in my room and the screen kept doing like jump scare flash things at me. And the the music was really creepy, and then like seeing these people do this little creepy dance. See there, that flash, the flash. Do you see the flash that I'm talking about? The little jump scare flashes. <laughs> that <laughs> it freaked me out. So I was like, I was creeped, honestly. Like I mean, I wasn't like scared, but definitely had a little creepy vibe to it. <laughs> it was very fun, very very fun. It's nice to be spooked a little every now and then. It definitely preparing me for the Halloween season. <gasps> Look at her pet. Oh my gosh. I want mine to do that. The little flower trail. Ah, oh, that was so cute. You can get your pets to do different things like that. There's, um, there's an area in the pet center that you can go and do that. The pet center in town. So be sure to check that out. All right, so we did all of her dailies. You'll know that we're done when she's just got the, the chat dots. Let's go down here and get to the little boy lost in the bathroom. Poor boy. We will come save you. Okay, in here, there he is. Ah, be gone, ghost. Or, oh, you're not a ghost. Nope, I'm not a ghost. It's okay. I am human. Here to save. Come on. Follow me, little boy. Oh, I think it's a boy. I don't know. Mm, jump scare. Ah. <laughs> Free at last, yay. There you go. And that's it, done. Took care of those, marked them off. Let's go ahead and go into the event and see if we get get anything. I, let's, ooh, I've got like 2,000 of them now. Good, I can get this bookshelf because I didn't have that before. That actually looks all right. I thought it was like all broken down and decrepit and stuff, but it's it's not that bad. Ah, got the hair, that's fun. And then let's do, um, honestly, I don't need any of this stuff anymore. Ah, uh, let's do two of these. Do we have enough for it? Yeah, we do. Okay, sprout points. That's what that is, it's just sprout points. 360 and I've got 330. Oh, I don't have enough for it. Dang it. All right, let's do um, a door. I don't have a door yet. Ah, it's a purple. See, that's what I'm talking about. That load screen that happened that takes a while for it to go through, that's, that's the irritating thing for me. So if you're opening card packs and you get like three purples in a card pack, you're gonna be bored sitting there waiting for that little animation to play through. So I hit open all to get it all out the way. Oops. 
And then after you have completed those daily quests, then you can go to the map over here and hit map and fiddle load. And you can see these exclamation points. Those are different quests that you can do. So you can go around and take care of those. You can do those once every single day to get extra Kaya stars. I have an abundance of Kaya stars, so I don't really need to do any of those. So I don't do them. Um, what I do from here is either go and sleep at one of the like farming spots so like if it's like in the middle of the day or whatever and it's not even close to reset time you'd want to be here but if it's near reset time you probably want to be in the bank because that's where most most of the people are if you want to farm likes or if you want to go and do a game game zone thing you know you can go and do that or oh i know another thing that we didn't do was tend to my flowers and my pets that's right so let's go home now to go home I could either go to the subway station over there and hit the hometown and go and find my house or I can tap my profile and tap the house and hit visit house and instead of it putting me outside my house it'll put me directly inside my house and ready to go so let's go do that Let it load. There we go. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Okay. Um, I like to turn everything on when I get home. Just because I need the lights. So we'll turn everything on. Oh, <laughs> by the way, if any of you like um, Chobits... What do you think of my new little NPC's name? If it'll show it. Okay, be quiet, girl. Yuzuki? <laughs> I couldn't not. I saw the little maid outfit and I had to make Yuzuki. I wish her hair was braids, though. It would be better if it was braids. Yuzuki is a character in an anime called Chobits. Okay. Let's go ahead and take care of the pets. Now this isn't something that you can do once every day. You can do this multiple times a day. It's just, it's going to remind you on your cell phone constantly if you don't have it going. So I like to keep it, keep it rolling. Plus, I mean, if you're trying to hatch the pets, you know, like you're trying to hatch these eggs or if you're trying to level your pet up, you know, you want to make sure that you're tending to them. And I'm going to go out here and plant fresh flowers because I accidentally harvested some of my flowers from my decorative pots and I wished that I hadn't done it. After I did it, I was like, no, why did I do that? So I'm going to replant them. I, I harvested all three of the ones that I had in here and then I harvested all of the ones I had up here because I was like, why can I not grow trees? And I don't know, I, I just messed something up. I was bugged. But if you're wanting to grow plants for like decoration purposes like this, don't just don't harvest them and put down new pots wherever you want your new pots to be and plant your flowers that you wanna plant in your new pots. I want my blue flowers here. Let's get top down. Plant. And decrease water. And then plant that one. And whoop. This one. Water. All right, done. Dun dun, dun dun dun. Let's go in here. And I just want to check something out real quick. No, okay. Yeah, I can't. 
can't plant anything more. So it is either plants or, or trees. You can't have both growing at the same time, which I absolutely hate. <laughs> but, um, so yeah, that's it. Then you can, then you can, uh, either tend your, your pet if they have a want or like if you have a want, she's okay for now. Um, you can do that or you can go fishing or you can play the mini games or you can play the zombie virus game if it's nighttime. You can go mining for stone all around. You can go and farm collecting bugs and stuff and, and display your insects. Like you can display your fish. There's also insect displays that you can get. I'll show you up here. Yeah, these over here, little insect displays, and there's even frog displays. So if you catch the frogs, you can you can get the frog displays and stuff. So yeah, there's like there's like tons of things to do once you're done with all your daily missions and stuff. You could try to get a high score on this. Oh, they didn't beat my high score. Nice try though. <laughs> That's cool. When people come and visit your house, you'll see their score if they if they play your game. But I think I'm going to go fishing. Oh, that's right, fishing. I need to show you guys how to um, upgrade the fishing rod. Oh, perfect landing. All right. Um, so to upgrade the fishing rod, you go into your backpack, and you go over to tool, and you go to your, to your fishing rod, whichever one you want to focus on, because you can, you can do multiples. But I've got this one going, and you hit the, the little question mark, down in the corner and it'll give you the option to upgrade so as you're upgrading the highest score is s and then it goes a b c d f uh, so if you get an s you might want to lock it see how it can lock or unlock make sure it's locked because you want to lock that one in you don't want to re-roll the stats and basically you're just trying to get all of these to an s tier now, A is, like, really high, so I went ahead and locked for the A. I was good with either an S or an A. Um, but these two, I still need to get up because those Fs are horrible. So I think you can do that about once a day for how many free ones you get. And then if you want to buy more, obviously, you can buy more and unlock everything right away. But I have lots of patience. I don't mind waiting. <laughs> But yeah, so that is it. I'm going to end today's video here after I've gone over all of the dailies and everything and how you can get all the things and do all the things. I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, please remember to leave a like and hit that subscribe button down below because I make new videos all the time. And I will see you guys in the next one. Okay, thanks. Bye. 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 Bye.